the bad news just keeps on coming. Because apparently, none other than Chase Iron Eyes, the father of Dakota Iron Eyes, the abducted little Native American girl that Ezra Miller took away from her from her reserve, from her little fucking shitty ass huts that they live in with trash and filth all over the place. They don't even have running water. And they fucking have one outhouse toilet for the whole community. And it smells like ass. Ezra Miller took her away from there as soon as she took 18 years old. And drove her around across all the United States doing drugs and alcohol and ecstasy. Going bar to bar as he violated through chairs at people's faces. Sped on people. Hopped on bartenders' backs. Fucking punched a lady. Choked another pregnant woman. Uh, fucking started yelling obscenities at somebody outside of a Chili's restaurant and shit. And let's not forget, broke into a house drunk because he thought they were trying to get their liquor from their cabinets and shit while the people were out of town. So yeah, this little girl is basically an accomplice to all of that. And uh, originally, Chase Iron Eyes, the father of this little girl who, who ran away with this fucking degenerate Son of a bitch who gives the whole fucking trans non-binary community a bad fucking name. And destroyed the DC universe. The Snyderverse died because of you, you dumbass. <sighs> Her dumbass father has now dropped all charges. And it said, I am no longer pursuing any legal shit. This little girl is gold enough. She can go do drugs and get fucked up all she wants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what he said now. So Ezra Miller is cleared of another crime he did commit. Let's face it, there he is. That little girl, you tell me that's not somebody on drugs. The fuck that's not somebody on drugs. I don't know what that is. That little girl is so fucked out of her mind. She's leaning. She's fucking on morphine right there and shit. That little girl's fucked in, in the fucking head right there. She, she's not even present. Her consciousness is in another fucking plane of existence. It's just a husk of a body right there. Ezra Miller's all like, I'm still waiting for my fucking pill to kick in. I'm jealous. He said, fuck you. I don't know what the fuck's going on. I think Timmons is right. Ezra paid him. Obviously. Look, your daughter's 18. She's never coming back. Let me just give you some money. Just everything will be okay. This guy lives in a shithole anyways. So he said yes. He's only going to piss it away on alcohol or weed or some fucking drug and shit. I mean, you got to be on drugs if you're going to be walking around looking like this and shit. You got a dead fucking dog there on your fucking back stinking up the place. You're kind of carrying around a dead chicken. And I don't know, you got an accordion on your fucking chest and shit. I'm kind of embarrassed that you braid your hair like me, you dumbass. Hey, do you like this kind of content? How about giving this a like and a subscribe? And if you want to watch the full show, click on the link to the right or check the description.